I'm Mike Mouse 74 and this is a Transformers video review. Hey, what's going on, Mouseketeers? Mike Mouse 74 with a Transformers video review. From Transformers Robots in the Skies, this is Sideswipe versus Decepticon Anvil. So, taking a look in the back, here's Sideswipe in robot mode holding his weapon. Then again, here's Sideswipe in robot mode all armored up. Here he is in his vehicle mode. Then here we see Decepticon Anvil in his robot mode. Again, I'm not too sure what kind of mode these guys are in, but uh, on this side here, you can download the app. You can scan, and then you can unlock and play. So that just about does it for the package. Without further ado, let's get Sideswipe vs Decepticon Anvil out of here and see what they're all about. Okay, so taking a look at Sideswipe's vehicle mode, he has a red colored paint scheme. He has some blue paint apps for the lights in the front there and there. Some more blue paint apps for the side window there. And on the other side right there, he also has some blue paint apps for the windshield right there. He also has some gold paint details towards the back right there. And on the other side right there, some more gold paint details. Other than that, that's pretty much all the details you're going to get out of Sideswipe. Now for a comparison with Sideswipe in vehicle mode. Here we have Legends Sideswipe. So to transform Sideswipe into robot mode, you want to start by bringing the legs down all the way just like so and then you can flip the feet up like that with the front section you want to bring the front the front section back and down behind like that with the arms you want to unpeg the arms from the side of the body like so and then bring the arms all the way down and rotate like that do the same thing on the other side unpeg the arm from the side of the body bring the arm down and rotate the arm around just like so and all you have to do is unpeg the legs and then here you have Sideswipe in his robot mode. And the transformed Decepticon Anvil in his robot mode. All you have to do is just bring the feet down like so and then separate down the center. And here you have Decepticon Anvil in his robot mode. So taking a look at Sideswipe details in robot mode, he stands at 4 inches tall. So for the articulations of Sideswipe, his head can look left and can look right. His shoulders can move up and down like so. He has ball jointed elbows. His elbows can move up and down just like that. He has ball jointed hips. His legs can go forward and back as well as side to side. And I think he's got a hinge down here by his knees. He has some good posability for his knees as well. So that's some articulations for Sideswipe. For a comparison of Sideswipe in robot mode, here is Legend Sideswipe. So Sideswipe comes with a bunch of accessories that you can attach onto him. There's two holes up at the chest, there's a hole on each side of the arm, there's two holes in the leg here, and two holes on the other side. So you can take the the chest uh, the chest guard and plug that on like so and then bring the face mask up like that and then with the uh, leg guard with these you have to use a little bit of force to actually plug these on and then do the same thing with the other leg again you have to use a little bit of force to plug these on and then take these claws type thing and plug it on the side of the arm of Sideswipe like that and then do the same thing with the other one take the other claw and plug it on the other side of the arm like so and then this here is supposed to clip on to the wheel and it's a little tricky to do
just give that a good push. And it's supposed to stay on like that. And then bring that down. And then you can take the uh, the weapon and plug it on these on the fist of size wipe. Like so. And this is how it, and this is what it's supposed to look like when all said and done. You can also combine the weapons together. You can take this one and then take the uh, the chest guard. There's a couple of holes on either side. Take the chest guard, plug that on like that. And then take this piece here and slide that on like that. And then all I did with this is attach the, uh, the claw onto the uh, leg guards and plug that on Like that, and then do the same thing with the other one. Again, all I did was take the claw and plug it onto the uh, uh, the leg guard, and plug this on here just like that. And it's supposed to give them some kind of giant claw. And then you can have side swipe hold it if you want. Just kind of slide it in, in the fist, like so. And there you go. So to transform side swipe back to vehicle mode, you want to take the arms, rotate the arms around so the gold is facing outwards. Do the same thing with the other arm, rotate the arm around so the gold is facing towards you. And then you want to take the whole entire arm, lift the arm up like that, do the same thing with the other arm, rotate the arm up all the way just like that. And then you can actually kind of peg the arm or the arms in alongside the body just like that do the same thing with the other arm you can plug the arm in alongside the body just like that and then you want to take the the front end of the set the front end of the car and then bring that up and over there's a couple of tabs on the inside right here just plug that in you can plug the leg together like so Take the feet, rotate the feet up in like that, and then bring this up and over like this. Give everything a good squeeze. And here you have side swipe back to his vehicle mode. And just make sure everything's all nice and nice and tight and whatnot. And there you go. And to transform anvil, all you have to do is just kind of bring these together like so. And locking that into place. And there you go. So I think that is pretty much going to wrap things up for another video review. This is Might Mouse 94, and you've just seen from Transformers Robots in the Skies, this is Sideswipe versus Decepticon Anvil. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, support the mouse, support your Transformers community, stay tuned for lots more reviews to come. Join me and all my friends in my Facebook group called Might Mouse 94 is the Mousetrap. You can follow me on Twitter. I also have a Might Mouse 94 community. All the links will be posted down in the description down below. I want to thank everybody for watching. And as always, guys, take care, everyone.